All right, guys. So going from where we left off yesterday, once I have kind of an advanced selection here, you know, maybe I want to show this motion that this thing's able to do. Um, you know, maybe I just want to be able to detail this portion out on a drawing. Um, you can save a display state. So if you have the isolate command open, you can hit save, right? And just give it a name. And what that's going to do is show up over on your configuration tab, right? You should have, you know, your default display state and then whichever uh, name you've given that uh, display state. But um, these are really helpful over like configurations and they're actually kind of tied to configurations also, depending on how your, your file set up. But, um, you know, if you went and you suppressed something, its mates would be gone and you would be able to see exactly how it's moving. However, if you're doing a display state, you're just hiding stuff. Those mates are still there. Those components are still there. Um, but a display state is, is a very useful tool for letting you show just a portion of that model. It can also be very useful for large assemblies if you just want to load a portion of the model without having to fully resolve everything else. So uh, hopefully this helps you guys. Have a great day.